Is alcohol haram, Z? Yes. Is that why you don't drink? Uh, originally, yes. And then uh, just, you know, growing up, I decided it's a, it's a good thing that I don't drink, even though I'm not religious. When I was younger, yeah, I mean, I did everything based on my religion. Pillow, why are you laughing? There's, there's a lot of people who I don't think should drink. Mention someone. Uh, like, I, I'm not talking about someone specific. I mean, like, there's just people in the world who, like, can't handle their alcohol intake. And they always get, like, blackout drunk whenever they drink. Like, every weekend. And eventually, it's gonna, it's gonna kill them. If you got this far without it, then all the more power to you. A lot of people in their mid-30s, I know, that have, that have realized they wasted their 20s just drinking all the time. You're literally following me. Yes. Some people do that shit daily. Yeah. Some people, they always drink and drink and cope with drinking and drink some more. They'll, there's a lot of people who just will use any excuse to drink. Oh, I had a bad day at work. I'm a drink. Oh, this girl's not texting me. I'm a drink. Oh, uh, you know, my, it hasn't been my day. I'm a drink. You know, I'm a celebrate. I'm a drink. No matter what the reason. Yeah, it's an addiction. Alcohol and cigarettes. Even weed. Like, you can get addicted to that shit. There's there's people who go like oh I can't function with, function without my weed I got I just gotta smoke weed and then I I could I could go out through my day. If you ever have to tell yourself that I think you're addicted. And my advice to you guys is to find a hobby that uh, you obsess with, that is a hobby that will uh that will by obsessing with it will actually lead to good things. Like let's say writing right, or drawing. Or doing YouTube videos or twitching on the Twitch. That's fucked up. Uh, what's fucked up is by the time people realize the addiction cycle, it's too late and their body relies on it. Uh, I've seen people try to quit drinking and get the shakes and shit. What's even worse is that all this shit is legal and not like supervised. Like, bro, you can you can drink as much as you want. You could, you could buy as many cigarettes as you want. This, these countries are fucked up, man. And you want to know why there's no regulation on that shit? It's because they make too much money, bro. There's too much money. Everything leads back to money. This, and the same thing with gun laws, too. Like, it all leads back to money. There's just too much money. Capitalism says, uh, fuck your health. We need, we need your money first. Okay? Give us your money, okay? First and foremost. Fuck your health. And we don't care about helping you. It's glamorized too, like half of the TV shows out there, just uh, people drinking all the time and it's normal to do that. This guy better not be touching cars. Yeah, you better not be touching cars. It's a sad truth out there, man. And like, I always talk to people too. They're like, man, you don't drink? You, you've never drank? Bro, like, I wish I was like you. I'm like, wait, what? Like, a lot of people tell me that. Like, a lot of my friends, too, in, like, high school, and, like, if I run into them, like, if I go to a party, and, like, people from my high school are there, they be like, what, you don't drink? You've never drank? Bro, I, I fucking wish I was like you, man. Yo, good job, bro. I wish I was like that. I'm like, I always found that weird. Like, the people who love drinking the most, they're always telling me that? Like, something doesn't add up here. <laughs> Why is it the people who always party are the ones that are like, man, yo, that's, that's, that, yo, that respect, respect, bro. It's like they know they shouldn't be doing it. That's weird. No one ever tells me that. When I when like I'm talking to people about this face to face. Z, I remember having this addiction conversation with you before. I never got that empathy and support you showed. Never forget. Uh Zero, you know my my memory is hazy. I remember having this addiction conversation with you before. I never forgot the empathy, that empathy and support you showed. Zero, I wish I remembered that. <laughs> You're welcome though. Uh, my friends are annoying as fuck trying to get others to drink with them. Uh, no, I get that too. Like, people always tell me, like, yo, just a sip, bro, just a sip. I'm like, nah, it's all good. They're like, ah, okay, okay, it's whatever. <laughs> it must be a Canadian thing. Uh, no, maybe you're just around shitty people, Stellar. Like, the only time my friends force me to drink is when they're too drunk, right? Like, if they're not drunk, like, if they just started drinking, they don't force me. But when they're, obviously when they're too drunk, people do stupid shit when they're drunk. That's literally the only time they bug me. It's cool if you don't remember. I do. And it was uh, when I needed it the most. That's good, Zito. And that's the goal of my channel. I want shit like that. Even though I don't remember helping people. I know I help people. <laughs> and it's not about me remembering. It's about the deed. Okay. The reason why you help people is because of glory. Yes. It's the feeling after. If, if whenever you do something nice and you don't feel good. After you do it, there's something wrong with you. 
Because I, 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 I bet anybody to prove me wrong. I bet anybody to prove me wrong. Fix the sub goal. Okay, I'll do that. I bet anybody to prove me wrong with this what I'm about to say. I bet you guys have never done something nice for someone. And you didn't feel good about it. We all, we all know there was one time we did something nice for someone and we fucking felt great. I know you, I know you guys can't tell me otherwise. Unless, like, they, they said, like, they didn't appreciate it. Then, okay, yeah, then it doesn't feel good. But if they, if, if they don't, anything other than that, like, you guys feel good. And I just need people to understand that. Like, that's why you help people. Because it, it actually makes you feel better. But a lot of people just help people just because just they want something. Uh, diagram? Don't want that. Do I want that? This hand is trash! I should have kept that in my hand! Yeah, I should not have activated the field spell. The only time you don't feel good is when they, like, they obviously don't appreciate it. But, other than that, you do feel good. Whether it's giving a hobo a dollar, or someone be like, Oh my god, I can't believe you did this for me. I think the, I think that the 18th Amendment was about it. Uh, I know my history. Uh, what are you talking about? Z, says Tana. I, uh, I don't drink much, uh, especially beer. I hate the taste. I used to drink a lot, but knowing my family history with alcoholism, I realized it was a problem quick and chilled out. Uh, still do from time to time, but not very often. <laughs> Wait, did, did I get ashed? Nah, I didn't get ashed. Yo, let's go. Let's let him go full combo. Oh, wait, I forgot. We went... Nah, I didn't let him go full combo. I remember drinking with the homies and we was jamming Mortal Kombat. And I want so much this dude got pissed and busted out his double barrel shotgun. I've always been one to help people out and there and be there for friends. But unfortunately, people don't... Ab people abuse knowing that. I've actually... Uh, hot and salty. I've actually talked about this a lot on my stream. People who, who, who get taken advantage of the most of the other people who like are nice. So that's why sometimes it, it seems like I go from 100 to 0 or 0 to 100. At first, like I'm all nice. But then once I see someone, you know... I'm seeing something that reminds me of, like, I know where this is going to lead to. And then I turn into an asshole. It's because I've been through this so much times. It's where you're nice to someone and then you end up fucking regretting it. The problem is, is that you guys are being too nice. And then when people see someone being nice, whether it's your, your fucking girlfriend or someone you're dating or your friend, you get taken advantage of if you're too nice. It doesn't matter who the fuck you are. If you're too nice, people take advantage of you. It's just, it's just our, our human instinct. It's just normal for a human being to do. That's why it doesn't matter who it is. You just gotta watch. You just, you always gotta keep it in the back of your mind. If you don't keep it in the back of your mind, you're gonna get fucking smacked.